Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Laura Yamada. And I'm Paula Akana. The Coast Guard tonight continues to search waters off Kauai South Shore for two people missing on an aircraft that reportedly went down more than 10 hours ago. A kayaker called police about 11.30 this morning to say he saw an aircraft go down about 100 yards offshore of Glass Beach. The special light sport aircraft is owned by Big Sky Kauai. Missing tonight and presumed dead are the pilot, company owner, Jim Gaither, and a passenger. The Coast Guard and Kauai Fire Department searched by boat, helicopter, and plane for any sign of the missing aircraft or the two people who were on board. They're concentrating their search several hundred yards offshore of the Kauai Coffee Company in Kalaheo, where the fire department says they have found what they believe to be debris from the aircraft. Missing is the pilot, 55-year-old Jim Gaither of Hanapepe and 49-year-old Kim Burgell of Spokane, Washington. This is video of Gaither off the website of Big Sky Kauai, which he owned. Those who knew Gaither say he is an accomplished pilot who has been flying in Hawaii for several years. He had a student that had signed up for a lesson, took them up, and so he was, had done an hour out and return flight from the Port Allen Airport and was on approach back to the Port Allen Airport and something went horribly wrong. The FAA confirms the aircraft was an experimental Windsport Edge XT912L. Those who fly them call them special light sport aircraft and say they're very safe. Strict guidelines for maintenance, certifications, and licensing for anybody to take anybody up for compensation. 